I kind of in some ways worry that it's like the Emperor's New Clothes with film photography because I watch a lot of videos talk about how you can't capture the film look in digital and, and the way that it handles highlights and um, exposure and light in general and colour uh, color rendition. And I sometimes think, am I seeing these things because I've been told that's what to expect in film photography, but I remember the first time I, I shot some on this and I got them back from the developers and I was just blown away. It was like, I looked at the photos, photos and I thought something like, I can, I can make these. I can, you know, it's within my reach to make things that have this effect when I look at them. Uh, I'm not saying that effect, you know, is on everyone, but when, when I looked at those photos I'd taken, and I'd seen thousands of photos I'd taken with digital cameras, and some of them I, I really love, but there was just an extra element in it when I, when I looked at the photos that I'd taken with the, uh, with the film camera. Uh, and even if that is just like a kind of placebo or um, some cognitive bias, um, I think I'm okay with that as well because the process is rewarding in itself. The slowing down and the, the composition and waiting to get your photos back and knowing that each photo is, you know, either a 112th or 136th of your entire roll. And even if that experience of, of the wow that I get out of film photography when I look at my photos, and even if that's an illusion, I'm, I'm still in. It's always a siren when I start to record things. And I forgot what I was going to say. Something about film photography. I think it's easy to get... It's easy to get caught up in trying to be a photographer. And you, the danger there is that you're influenced by too much by current photographers or, or work that you see around or on Instagram. And you, you're more trying to replicate the photographs which you see other photographers make um, rather than finding the photographs that you need to make. When you see the sh a shot and you know it's going to be magical and, and just you know, you're taking a step back, step forward, and you, you frame in, and you know everything else goes quiet, and I don't know your breathing slows down. It just it's, it's I think it's what they call it the flow zone. It's when you know you're completely absorbed by something, and and then there's that final moment where you, you press the shutter button and there's the, the click, and then um, then you just wait and see.